these mini MLB batting helmets are going to be building my MLB The Show team today. All right, helmet number one. What do we have here? We have a Washington National helmet. So we're going to be adding somebody from the Nats to this team. Now, starting out with the Nats is going to be great because we have three goals that we're trying to accomplish today with this team build. And that's to add five parallel five players to the team. Only use five 99 overall base cards and add at least one player from every 2022 playoff team to the squad. Thankfully for me, though, with the Nationals, we have home run derby Juan Soto and he's P5. So we're starting off. We're using one of our 99s. We're knocking out one of those parallel fives. Helmet number two. What do we have? It's like a magic trick dip, dipping in here. I don't know what I'm going to get. We're staying in the NL East. We're keeping it red. The Philadelphia Phillies. We're getting so incredibly lucky because I have a Philly. He's not a 99 and he's parallel five. That is is p5 postseason roy holiday and i'm also more than happy to start this card on the bump it's gonna be important that we can limit runs because as you can probably see these are actually mini ice cream helmets so i'm gonna fill these up with ice cream whenever we hop into a game with this team for everyone i give up the controller has to be put down and a scoop of ice cream has to be consumed before i can continue playing the show goes on what do we got Number three, let's get deep in here. It is going to be the Toronto Blue Jays. We're going to go three for three on parallel five cards because I think I've underestimated the lack of grass that I touched this year. And I got Josh Donaldson P5 too. That is our second 99, but it's also our third P5. We only have two left. I don't think I have that many P5s though. I do think we're just getting really lucky out the gate. I touch grass sometimes on occasion. Did we or did we not touch grass day we went on a walk today okay it, it doesn't she's not responding we went on a walk today every single day thank you we got five parallel fives in a row the cincinnati reds is going to be the next one now i do want to save some 99s where we can so here in left field for the reds i'm going with a bit of a different choice we're gonna be adding future star austin hendrick to the team and that may seem like an interesting decision the 95 overall and look at the set 1500 ops over 111 games the numbers don't lie I kind of dig this card a ton. Four down, we continue on here, and we are going to be moving on to the Kansas City Royals. I think we got to go with that very first collection reward. You know I have them, Parallel 5 as well. We're going to be able to throw them at first base on this team to knock out our fourth Parallel 5 player in six hats that we pulled. What does the magic bag of hats have for us next? We need some playoff teams on here. And we are getting one right there. It is the New York Mets, the next team up. And we actually have a P5 on the Mets as well, but he only plays third base in left field. And I have to fill out my lineup and my rotation before I can start attacking the bench. So we don't have anywhere that we can put Brett Beatty, unfortunately. I don't know if I want to use a 99 overall spot here as well. Now, we do have this 93 Eduardo Escobar, or we could go with lighter. For me, though, maybe a bad decision. We're going Eduardo Escobar. We get another playoff team right here. We're going it quick. It is the Milwaukee Brewers. I really don't think I have a parallel five Milwaukee Brewer. I think our fifth one is going to have to wait here. We have we just miss having Corbin Burns parallel five. We just missed Prince Fielder as well, both parallel fours. All right, we're going to go this 97 Corbin Burns. We're not going to waste a 99 spot, and we're going to fill out another spot in our rotation. Oh, great. Trash bag full of mini helmets. What do we have next? The Tampa Bay Rays. We do knock out our fourth postseason team, which is big. We have two 99s left. I want them to be impactful. We could do Vidal Brujan. If we do a position player, it does have to be either a catcher or shortstop or a center fielder. Let's do it. Let's throw Rain down the team. We'll make it work. All right, catcher, shortstop left, some starters and the bench. What do we have next? Oh, this one's stuck together. It's got to be a good one. It is the Baltimore Orioles, almost a playoff team. Maybe going to be a playoff team in 2023. Yankees, Blue Jays. Give me Orioles third in the AL East, 2023, and snagging a wild card spot. But y'all let me know what y'all think they're doing. I don't even need to think about this one. It's Adley Rushman. I got to get him on the squad and give me a catcher. Only one lineup spot left. If we had a lineup spot, it's got to be a shortstop. We could get down bad if this gets too bad. And we have the Angels here. We're not going to get a shortstop option from the Angels, unfortunately, nor is it a playoff team. Okay, I lied. There is a shortstop. Luis Renjifo got a tops now. I think I want to roll the dice and try to get a better shortstop. So we're going to add 
this 97 all-star game otani we need a shortstop so badly i'm trying to think of what team could give us a good shortstop that world series mvp seager would be so sick okay if i reach in here right now and i pull out the dodgers and we had world series mvp seager y'all gotta like this video and subscribe to the channel right now i'm digging it deep we're mixing it up what do we got uh, uh it, it, the opposite of the dodgers i guess the the detroit tigers we spend our last 99 to add a shortstop just for it to be alan trammell that's a bad move i can't do it i can't like for my pride i can't have alan trammell out there i simply cannot have that so i'm going with jackson job i'm not even we're not even doing hal newhauser we're going jackson job low-key got on p3 kind of a demon come on big money what do we got we got another one stuck together and we have the colorado rockies and you know what we have with the rockies we got a 99 overall we got a shortstop trevor story Woo we got one more rotation spot left that we're gonna quickly fill out the bench what do we have for our final rotation piece is gonna be the texas rangers easy addition here we're going with martin perez not a playoff team in 2022 playoff team in 2023 though after spending all that money again this offseason not biased not biased i think so i think so unfortunately with 12 total playoff teams we're still missing eight and with five bench spots obviously we are not going to be getting every playoff team so a massive l on that one i'm gonna quickly fill out the bench we got the braves out the gates next up here we we got the twins how bailed is this low key i forgot to get a fifth parallel five player but we got joe mauer it counts i don't know I'll, I'll put him in the starting lineup i totally forgot to get any more <laughs> but i'll put him in the starting lineup three spots left what do we got the houston astros now all the playoff teams are rolling through Some righties on the bench here at the end of st louis cardinals and finally the final pull here is the miami marlins hey by the time you're watching this video we have a cover athlete being jazz chisholm it was just teased today the day i'm recording this video so i don't know who it is i think it is gonna be jazz so you know what for fun let's add jazz in here he has that face of the franchise card doesn't he let's add the face of the franchise jazz on there maybe a little it the show 23 cover athlete teaser i don't know oh man i hope we can pitch well i hope we can pitch well Oh no, oh no, oh no, oh no, oh no, oh no, oh no! Come on, come on, come on. On there! On there! Yo, Halo Top, low calorie though, by the way. Health first, baby. I put way too big of a scoop in this first one. Oh, that's inside. Ah, okay. Woo, three, two. Oh my God. I want to do all that to pop up. Oh my God. After giving up an early run, the offense would bounce back with this Soto home run, but my opponent was hitting much better than I'd like. Thankfully, though, Ramon was shining down on me to bail me out of the second inning. George Brett. Double, double play. Yeah. Oh, 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 double. So sad. <laughs> That's so sad. I actually feel bad. I couldn't even control that. I there's nothing I could do there. The offense would continue to roll off of this Roy Halliday triple, but the good vibes would quickly turn around to start the third inning. We're there. We're there. Please, Randy. Please, Randy. Please, Randy. Please. Woo! Randy! Wait. 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 No, he got all the way to third. Dang it. I thought he was going to turn around. We were going to get him at second. Yes. Come on. Wait, dude, do I walk and set up a double play? Yes, I do. Ray. Oh, no, 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 no. What are we doing? Are you for real? Ah, uh, he can freaking... Please, for real, bro. Out. Oh. out of the inning. George! Oh, he finally went high, and we let it fly. Oh, God. 
Another big one. Oh, this is so bad. Are we there, Juan Soto? Thank the Lord. Three to five. I need to end this game ASAP. Unfortunately, the game would not be ending soon because after this George Brett home run, we would not be able to score another run, but still found ourselves just three outs away from winning this game with only giving up three no runs. No nanny, no BS. Clean inning. There's so much ice cream in this one. I'm feeding on care. I'm winning this game. I don't care. Live senior, GG. Been a good game. Been a good one, folks. Uh, that's going to do it for us today here at YouTube slash Ants. He wins, okay? He wins. I can't. He wins, okay? He wins! Go up the middle! We're scoring on it! Oh, I'm toast. I'm toast. I'm toast. I'm toast. I'm toast. I'm toast. Well, if you enjoyed seeing me suffer eating this ice cream, You'll probably like to watch me eat a hot dog for every home run I hit with Babe Ruth right here.